I can only transport one crate at a time. One crate at a time. Well, time for more uh, talkies. Uh, All good. right. What Dreamcast games do you have, Nick? Is it? Is it? Um, Sonic Adventure, Sonic Shuffle, Zombies Revenge. I just got that today. I'm throwing our, uh, our local video game hunt for retro games. Batteries low. Okay, I said mine. Okay, mine is. Cause I, yeah, I need to say, alright, Mark, your turn. Um, so I got Sonic Adventure 1, Sonic Adventure 2, Race Taxi, Power Stone, um, Hydro Thunder. I recently just bought Alpha 3. Ooh. Oh, wait. Um, Dead or Alive 2. Actually, I can just look on here. Actually. Also, um, I, I guess you... I, you know what? I feel fine shilling that app, because it's a good app to use. Um, if you're uh, doing video game collecting, oh, and so you want something to catalog your uh, video games, I recommend using the app GameEye. We're not sponsored by them. We're not sponsored by them, but I like the app, so... Because it catalogs, all, you, you, it's easy to catalog all the stuff you have. Right? You can either scan it or manually putting it in. So if anybody ever asks you, hey, do you have this? Or you'd be like, do I have that game? Yeah, you can you can have that on file. I, I, so, okay, to tell you what I, what I was say, talking about all the games I got on Dreamcast. I got Soul Calibur. I got Choo Choo Rocket. Ready ready to Rumble Boxing Round 2. And uh, Quake 3. But the thing I like the most out of the the app is the fact that uh, it shows uh, the value of the things you bought, slash um, how much there are on an average. So if you're like going to your local shop, and you're like, oh wow, look at this price. Then you go look at the prices they have on the app. They'll let you know if you're spending too much money for certain things. Now, as the thing on the app. It doesn't mean those prices are the exact prices you're gonna find on eBay and shit. It's more like an average kind of thing. Like, oh, prices for here, like, let's say... Uh, let's, let's say, like, uh, Zombies Revenge. The average price for, like, a complete in-box will be, like, let's say, let's say, like, 45 And I spent Zombies Revenge... I spent 50 on Zombies Revenge at our, our game store that we go to. I'm like, uh, I only spend the little, like five more than than the what the app says. So, and we can't tell you what the game store is because, because look, look, here's another rule about game stores: don't tell anyone about where you get your games at your game store, because if you do, then people are gonna start coming there and buying all of our shit, like bloody roar. <laughs> yes, when I went there, I only got I got the bad one. Yeah, bloody roar four because uh. They were like, hey, we got Bloody Roar, and we were like, oh man, I want Bloody Roar, because we were in we were uh, in Florida on vacation at the time, so we couldn't get it. So we were like, as soon as we get back home, we're going to get it. But then, then as soon as we came back home, literally, actually, the funniest thing is, as soon as we get there, someone was like, already buying Bloody Roar 3. Not 3. Was it, uh, was it well, Primal Fury? Yeah, Primal Fury. So, okay. So that's, that was very saddening. Yeah, he said, I just bought I just bought one just now. I was like, no! I, even though you like, could you just try to buy it off the dude? I said, that means I'll be paying more than I would originally would have bought it for. Yeah. I don't want the game that bad. Like, I want the game. I don't want it that bad. But yeah. Also, I wanted to get Legend of Zilla Twilight Princess on the GameCube. That was there, too. Well, they showed it off on, what was it, uh, Facebook, Twitter? Facebook. They, showed, they had it, which uh, Mark really wants that one for some fucking reason. Yeah, I don't have a Wii U. And he doesn't want to use the Wii? Yeah, well, he doesn't have the Wii either, so. Well, I have the Wii, 
But I, I want my own weed. Mm. Like you not you don't have a weed? I do have a weed, but I want <laughs> I want the be okay. <laughs> weed. But uh yeah. Oh I killed Mark. But remember Nick, Mark never existed. Mm. But um Yeah. Because, because I, because you know, the the best version of Twilight Princess is, you know, the, the HD one, is on the, but it's only on the Wii U, which I really hope Nintendo at some point re-releases Twilight Princess and Wind Waker HD on uh, on the Switch because uh, more people need to play those games. All right. And I don't, and I, and those games are going up in price because I only have Wind Waker. I don't have a uh, uh, Twilight Princess HD. I have Twilight Princess on the Wii. But I want the HD version. Since we're here, um, let's let's talk about all your Sega Genesis games. What Sega Genesis games do you have, sir? Well, I gotta look at the app if I want if I want to remember everything. But uh, going by memory, as you know, I I have all the Sonics, excluding uh, me being. Oh no. But uh, I ex I have all the Sonics, excluding like Mean Bean. But um, I have Rocket Knight Adventures, uh, Pac Man Two. You've seen that on the channel. Uh, Ninja uh, the Ninja Turtles Hyperstone Heist. Uh, fucking. You already said Sonic and Knuckles, right? Yeah, I, I said all the Sonics, excluding uh, Mean Bean. Um, Rocket Knight. I already said Rocket Knight. Um, uh, Bomberman, oh, uh, Bomberman, uh, what was it, Mega Bomberman? I have that. Uh, um, like, unfortunately, I'm working, so I can't look at, I can't look at the, at the app. I can look for you. <sighs> okay, but I gotta unlock my phone. <laughs> Give me my phone back so I can unlock it. Alright. I can do it myself, Lord Jesus! No, you're gonna skim around and then you're like, not when we're streaming. Cause I, I cause I, this one, once we save, we gotta do it. It's break time. Lunch time, eh? Or, or, oh, what are you doing? Work. You're looking. You're stuck. I was on the wish list. You had to get on the wish list. All right, report. Okay. Eagle Genesis games. Nick got. He has a bad at Rocket Knight. No. Hmm? Man. Oh. Oh, this is important. Pay attention. No, that's okay. Don't be shy. Stand there. Here we go. Both of you get in closer. This is very oh. important, Mark. You gotta make this decision. That's it. Here goes. Which do you want? Yo? Which one should Ryo get? And which one should Nozomi get, Mark? Ryo get the one y'all separated. Give her the one y'all together. Yes. She gets upset if you take the other one. <laughs> I took the other one because I thought it would be funny. Ria looks so fucking mad. Bitch, who, who said you could take my picture? Why is she here? Yeah, so that's all the games you got on, on here, Nick. Going to Canada. On the oh. Genesis. What? I took a while to decide, but... Hey, if it's what you've decided, it's what you've decided. Ryo, don't do anything stupid. He's moving of away. Course he won't. I'll always treasure this. Ryo, take care of yours too. Why is she moving? I will. I don't know. I'll come back when I'm on vacation. Oh, sure. Sure. Like, vacation? Bye then, Ryo. Oh, oh. she looked really upset. It's on me. Hey. I wonder what's, why is Nozomi so upset? Oh well. Yeah, so all the games you just said, that's all you have on here. Oh, okay. Badly. 
I mean, Mark, sad. Have you seen any of oh, oh, this is so sad. I don't have every game in the library. No, because I thought you had more. But that's why I said sadly. I'm warning you. You best stay away from them. Are you threatening me? Hitoshi. Yo, is your lunch big enough for you? Yeah, it's plenty. You can have half of mine if you want. Thanks, I but say, I got some more appetites. Uh, sometimes I can't finish it, you know. Is that so? Excuse me. Yeah? Have you seen the mad angels around? I don't know anything about them. Ask the foreman. Yes. I want to hear what they talk about first. Bye. Hey, Tiyoshi. Hey, Ryo. Are you hiding something from me, man? No. You kind of got that look, you know, like you're hiding something. Well, I'm not. Yeah. Really? You sure? Well, you be sure to let me know if something's up. I uh, sound like yeah. a nosy motherfucker. Alright, so the standard game they got is, uh, Fighting Vipers, um, Virtual Fighter 2, not for resale. Yeah, the, the one that counts with the console. Fighting Vipers I have complete in box. Which is very rare. I mean, it's kind of rare for. Well, mo well, any Saturn game completing box is kind of rare. Uh, the Tona USA, not not for resale. Um, Deep Fear. Yes, but but we're wondering what the hell Deep Fear is. That's a uh, that that is Sega's made um, Resident Evil game. It plays like Resident Evil. I haven't ran. I played a little bit of it, but uh. I'll see how I feel. The only thing I can say about it is the voice acting is very, very bad in a very, very hilarious way. Um, you got Ooh. Panzer Dragoon 2. Uh, I have Panzer Dragoon Y, yes, 2. Ah, good. I want to check something. No win. Hmm. Oh, yeah, Sonic That's Jam. They got Sonic Jam on the side. Japanese. Japanese. It's why and um, Sonic Jam and Deep Fear I have Japanese copies of. I think that's all this that Sega any Well on um, Sega Consoles games you got. This, please. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. Alright, so you can take that. I can say all the same. Um sure, Sega stuff I got. Only, the only thing I stay with you. Uh, Dreamcast. And when we mean Sega stuff, I mean Sega brand, like Sega, like Genesis style, like, like that. the ones are on the Sega consoles. Yeah, because like, I, like obviously I have more Sega games because I'm a fucking Sonic fan. Of course I have more Sonic games, but specifically for the Sega consoles, those are the ones I have. You know, the thing we're playing is not on, like right now. It's yeah, not yeah, I'm not playing this on a Dreamcast. I'm playing this on a fucking PS5. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. Oh god. I was hyper cursed for a good second. I saw four sixes. Sure, draw a raffle ticket. Okay, so for the Genesis, I got Sonic 3 complete. Ooh. Oh, okay. Where you get Super Sonic now. Congratulations. Hopefully. Pick the one you like. Uh, so we'll what? No, it's in the other place. Well, just pick one of these. Man. I don't want any of these things. I want Super Sonic. Here you go. <laughs> Why? What the fuck am I gonna do with this for? What the fuck are you gonna do with Super Sonic? That's the only thing missing in the set. I have every other Sonic. No, I, actually, that's, actually, let me let me check that just in case. <laughs> Yeah, I have every Sonic character except Super Sonic. Ooh, bullshit. Okay, back to what I was saying. I have Sonic Three complete. I have Sonic and Knuckles, just the, the cartridge. I got a uh, Super it's Street right, Fighter Two, the new Challenger, just the just the box and the game. Also, I. Uh, 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 I know you're saying, but I also appreciate that the game didn't eat my money and give it back to me because I had to go back to work. I put a soda and put a money in the machine, but it gave it back to me. But uh, continue. I got a uh, golden axe, just the, the cartridge. I got a uh, Power Ranger, uh, the Power Ranger game, Power Ranger movie. 
I'm on, on uh, you guys both for the the fighting game and the the movie beat 'em up on the associates. Yes. I got Sonic Spinball complete. I got uh, Sonic cl cl uh, Classics. Cl right there, Sonic Classics. Um, just that I don't got the box. Oh wait, there's a Spinball. Is the Spinball that we had since kids considered yours or mine. Oh, I got. I did. Oh, did you? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You bought your own, right? I can have uh, the complete. Okay. Even though I don't know, I think you have that too. What? Yeah, the spinball. We had, yeah, the one we had as kids. That's complete in box. I I just bought one so when actually when we move away from each other, um, you'll have your own. Yeah. I care about the game enough that much. Uh, Primal Rage. That's all my Genesis games at the moment. Cause I, I think I bought I bought some today. I think I bought a uh, Sonic one complete. No, I don't know if it's complete. I was gonna get Virtual Fighter two on Genesis until Mark was like, "Nah, Nick, look, there's there's, there's a Lost Planet one." There you go. I was gonna get a Virtual Fighter two on Genesis, but then you uh, told me the good game. Told me like, "No, Nick, look, there's Lost Planet one." I'm like, "Oh, I guess it has, it has the bonus disc in there," so I just. Sure. Oh, I, I just remember you told me, you said, I think I might get that. Cause you yeah, but I was also thinking about getting V2. You can go whatever you wanted, man. That's, that's, that's your money. I was just saying that because you told me. I bought it because the, cause the had, it had everything in it. Yeah. Um, okay, for the Saturn, I only have, uh, so far I only got like two games on here for some reason. I have you. Oh, 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 I guess, uh, I guess technically I have that fucking, sp that Madden game too on fucking Saturn, but, uh, whatever. I got X-Men Children of the Atom, loot, just the CD, and I got, a uh, Bust the Move 2, complete. That's my only complete Sega Saturn game. That, that guy took up one more. But I, I mean, I can say it, cause, I mean. I also got Street Fighter 2 Alpha, uh, uh, Street, Street Fighter Alpha 2 complete on the Saturn. Yeah. But that's uh, that's for Christmas, so can't touch it until then. What? I think I. What? I don't think I got any Saturn games for Christmas. I okay. had more um, Sega Genesis games, but well, uh, well, I guess well for what I'm getting, I'm getting. I well, no, Mark bought me a Sega Master System game. So, uh, I didn't put that on the my list yet, but I have a Sega Master System game. Yeah, now, if y'all actually like, so, y'all have any other Sega games? I got, uh, I got t Crazy Taxi 3 on the Xbox, the original Xbox. Your own, the only Crazy Taxi game you're missing is 2, right? Yeah. I got, what me and him, me, me and Nick got Sonic Heroes, I got mine on the Xbox, Nick got his on the GameCube. Well, the only Sonic games I'm missing Outs like is like a pocket adventure. No, I'll say this: I have most of the Sonic games. The only Sonic games I'm missing is Pocket Adventure, Advance Three, Rivals Two. Um, I also got Sonic the Sonic Mega Collections for all three pla all three platforms. I got it for the GameCube, the Xbox, and the PS2. Free Riders. I don't have Free Riders for the Connect. Um. Uh. <laughs> this is like I have so many Sonic games. It's hard. I uh, I can't. I don't really like. There's not that many that I don't have at this point. Also got Sonic Adventure Two on the Dreamcast. That's also for Christmas. I don't have Sonic. I don't have Sonic Schoolhouse. <laughs> oh, I think to be honest, I got Sonic Adventure Two on Dreamcast and the GameCube. Yeah, I, I, I bought doubles of the games I really care about. Like, I got them for both systems. Um, well, I don't have them have, I, I don't have, a, like, all versions of Sonic CD, because I don't have the Sega CD version of Sonic CD. I need to go get that one, because I have, I, we do have the, I have, we have the PC version. That's how we first played Sonic CD as a kid. As kids. Um, and then we have the gems collection. We both got Sonic Adventure DX. Oh yes, we got Sonic Adventure 
on the Dreamcast and also on the GameCube. Um, I well, digitally, I have Nights in the Dream. I have the HD version of Nights in the Dreams, but uh, I have all the Nights games basically. I don't have Christmas Nights. I need to get that. Mm. And I do want an actual fizz cop of a, of a Journey of Dreams because I. Oh no, not Journey of Dreams. Into Dreams. Nights into Dreams, the first one. Journey of Dreams, the second one. I got um, um, Monkey Ball on the GameCube, the first one, the second one. Oops. No, because you don't have. Nothing. You got Monkey Ball, but you got a, like the Wii version. Uh, yeah. Well, I have the original. Well, oh, actually, I have actually have the original and the HD version of uh, Banana Blitz, and both versions aren't particularly good. I only bought Banana Blitz HD because it had Sonic in it. I got the. I also got the Super Monkey Ball Deluxe on the PS2. You have all the good ones, basically. I don't have the one on the Switch. Uh, I, yeah, I bought the one on the Switch. Yeah, you bought that. Like I said, you have all the good ones. You have one, two, and Deluxe. Oh no 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 no! no. There's one more. You got it's uh the last good Monkey Ball game was on the Game Boy Advance. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna get that. But it's the last good one. Don't care. You don't want good games? I'm not a handheld guy that I like that much no more. Even though you like you got the Switch, I said that's, that's the exception as a console as it as well. Oh, they got um I have the Persona uh, Three. Yeah, because I, I was gonna I wasn't gonna really bring up Atlas stuff, even though I, now they're owned by a. I wanted to hold that off before uh, I wanted to talk about the actual Sega stuff before talking about Atlas. Um, yeah, I got the Yakuza game. Well, I have Yakuza 0, 1, and 2 Kiwami. But yeah, I have those games. I gotta get, I want to get the uh, the rest of them through the, the HD remasters, but I haven't got around to getting them yet. Um, I have Jet Set Radio Future. Uh, I have Jet Set Radio the original digitally. But I don't have the, the fist cop of that. I got the Sonic Ultimate Genesis Collection for the 360 and the PS3. Also, I got the... Supposed to be, I supposed to have the Sega Collection on the PSP, which is not on here for some reason. Um, I have Streets of Rage 4. That's a really good game. Um... I guess the, um, the Wonder Boy games are owned by Sega because um, I do have Wonder Boy, uh, the, the 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 remake of Dragon Strap, and I do, and uh, that's the Sega Master game, it's a Master System game I do own physically. I do have the original uh, Dragon Strap on Master System, but uh, I do I I have Monster World Four and uh, a couple other ones digitally through the the Sega Vintage Collection. But, uh, I gotta get around to getting the remake of Monster World 4, even though it looks kind of booty cheeks, but I want to get it anyway, because I like- I actually really like that game when I played it digitally. I like to- well, the, the, the problem is, the thing that I really liked about it, because I, I liked it because it looked really good, and it had a lot of, uh, character and its animations and shit, but now it looks kind of budgeted and poopy. But I still want to get it out of, you know, so- if, if if it sells well, they'll keep making more games because uh, the last the last new one they made was a uh, what was that Monster Boy or whatever. I got that on PS4. If anyone has not played that game, legit, fucking go buy that because everyone slept on that game. I got um, Condemned Criminal Origins on the 360. And he was like, "What is that? That's awesome! Yeah, yeah, it's a the fire horror game that Sega made." Yeah, um, I have them too, but I have it on Steam. Yeah, I, mean, I, have, I just had the first one. I didn't get the second one. I also have Binary Domain on Steam. That's that uh weird, uh weird cop game that's made by the Yakuza guys. It's, it's really weird. Like it looks not like the game has nothing to do with Yakuza or anything. But when you uh, there's a point where you go to. Uh, to a basically an Asian place, and you, they, they, there's literally people that look like fucking Yakuza characters. It's very weird. But uh, what else? What other Sega things? Uh, okay, we don't count. Uh, so we don't say anything. Sorry, because 
Most I have already talked about the Sonic games I don't own, which was hard for me to think of because I have most of them. Like I only named like maybe like probably five that I don't have. Oh, Sega's Su Superstars Tennis. Uh, the, well, the racing games. I got it for the 360. The only racing game I don't have is the uh, the first one. Mark has the tennis one though. Oh, I, I, yeah, and I also have the one on the iToy as well. I have. That's the first Sega Superstars game. And, um, as we all know, I love Puyo. I have the Puyo games as well. I have uh, Puyo Puyo Tetris. I got that before it came out over here. I bought, that was my first Japanese import. Um, I have, um, Sonic Mania plus the, um, uh, physical copy. Yeah, I don't have a physical copy. I need to get around to getting it. I got digital and physical. Digital on the Xbox, physical on the, uh, for the Switch. God. I don't think cruising is... Cruising uh, is in the market. There's nowhere even near Seika. <laughs> that's, that's Nintendo. And, uh, well, Nintendo and, uh, what was it? I forget what the company actually Yeah, because, um, Sega had, uh, Outrun. Which, I recently did buy Outrun, but... I have Outrun on the Xbox. I just bought that today. Okay, good job. Here's today's pay. Thanks. You met quota, son. So starting tomorrow, you'll get a 50 yen raise. I bought all the scrolls. I don't know what to do with this. Thank you. Keep up the good work. You know, since yes, it's, it's kind of close, um, let's just do yours. Play, re play the rest of yours. I'll just Shenmue all night. Yeah. It's like, it's already getting close to one. Is there any point in me playing for a half an hour? I guess. But, um, other Sega games. I'm, I'm, I'm not starting with Atlas Do I make sure we got through with all the Sega shit. Um... I already said, well, I, um, I have Puyo, Puyo um, Fever on the GameCube. I've got something to ask you. Do you know where the Mad Angels hang out? I don't know. Ryo, I heard a rumor that you are going after the Mad Angels. I've got my reasons. Trust me. No, man. Do not go and get mixed up with them. If you know anything about them, please, Tom, you've got to tell me. Sorry, but I don't know, man. Really? Thanks, Tom. But uh, the fact that he's like, don't go after them. I'm going after them, and you can't stop me. And now, do you have any information? No. I was like, well, then that's that's where it ends, Tom. Well, we gotta wait until it's nightfall around here. That's because we already have information. We just gotta wait. Which, speaking of waiting, let's go talk to the old man so he can teach us something else. Well. Uh, yeah, I guess that too. Well, I mean, Excuse very dull looking. Eh? What is it, youngin? Do you happen to know where the Mad Angels hang? Why are you I here? You I really need to... If you oh, know... All right, right here, they always gather at night. I yeah, understand. Good. Don't go... I don't think he's gonna teach us something new every time. Uh, don't worry. Like, I was like, maybe we should, uh... Well, I, I, I'm gonna send the video game to let us know when it's nightfall, so... I'll check out check outside again after an hour. We got so much money, we can just buy a fuckload of stuff. Rio's rich. Well, he has like, comparing to American money, he's like around twelve bucks. So not really. I mean, not, not twelve bucks. I'm sorry. He has about uh a hundred, like a hundred or so dollars. So, I guess as a teenager, that's a lot. But he has a job, so that's not really a lot. Ah, good. Uh... I mean, I have Puyo 1 on my Switch. But I, I play 2 a lot, but I don't own 2. Hey, George, say you got Puyo Tetris? Yeah, that's the first thing I said. Oh, I got put. Well, I got the second one as well. That one has Sonic in it. You can I'll play as him. Please. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much.
What sure, marks? The next Sega theme game Mark wants to get is Bonanza Brothers. Yep. Yeah, a lot of um, Sega com get games complete is starting to raise up in price now. Well, that's a lot of like a lot of old games are raising up in price. I'll take this. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. Because uh, those the one the second game I really want to get into is Skies of Arcadia, but unfortunately it sure, gets expensive. It's hard to get. Because uh, well, Nicholas had a chance to get it on the Dreamcast though. Yeah, but I want the I want Skies of Arcadia Legends. No win. We just got both. No prize, eh? At least, like, like, at least you could have had the game and played it. Yeah. I also just wish they just fucking re-released the goddamn game. I'll take this. But something tells me the reason why they're not doing that because Sega lost all their assets to the video game. Then again, I don't know. Sega might just be Sega and be like, uh, they're not gonna sell. Even though they'll probably sell. Because like. I really want to play the Panzer Dragoon Sagas. Now, the real answer for that is, Nick, just fucking whip out an emulator, you idiot, and go play it. But I want to actually own it and play it. I know I could play it on an emulator, but I want to actually play it on my Saturn. This one. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. And you know, those Burning Rangers exists. Sure, and shit. A style exists. Clockwork. A clock, not Clockwork Orange. Clock. Yeah, Clockwork Night. That exists. I want to play those too. No win. That's too bad. Uh, what, what other Sega IPs are that I forgot about or we don't have? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. I, I guess I got I got a game to recommend to people. That's um that's only in the Japanese PS3 PSN store, which I recommend. Go get a fucking account and go pick this game up. It's called Dynamite Deca, which in America it's called um fucking Die Hard Arcade. No win. You can get it's all it's on the Saturn. So if you want to play it in American wise, you can play it on the Saturn. But Die Hard Arcade is legitly like a really good 3D beat 'em up. And also, it's Die Hard, so that's pretty cool. But um, the fun thing is, when they uh, when they eventually lost the license, they just switched it to calling it Dynamite Deco. Yeah, sure. And it's just it just it's it's very silly because I'm in a Project Cross Zone. They so they somehow got sure, away of putting Bruce Willis in fucking Project Cross Zone, even though you know they don't really own the license to that. But somehow they got him no in the game. Me. He's not actually him, but you know, it, it, it literally looks like Bruce Willis. Because it's supposed to be him. Yeah. Take the soda. After this soda, I'll check outside. I don't know how long it's been. Um, you also can talk about the Sonic movie. I guess I could talk about that. Well, what, what do you want to talk about it? Like, how do you feel about it? I, as someone who's a big fat Sonic fan, you're like, oh, did you love the movie? You know that? I just, I just kind of just thought it was okay. No, not not the. Ah, I mean, the, the trailer for the new one. Oh, the second one. I'm Knuckles is cool. The 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 Master Emerald isn't the correct size, but then again, Sega never really makes the correct size for the Master Emerald anyway. So, man. Yeah, I was like, I thought the Master Emerald was supposed to be huge. Oh! Long time no see. This is the guy who's been sniffing around us like a dog? Looks like we're gonna have to run this straight off now. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> oh! Ah! Trying to be cool. Ah! 
bike. I love that effect they do. Now I see why Rio rides a bike in the Sega game. I love how they did that effect there with the lights. Is it this his bike now, or is it, he just rides a bike because he rode a bike in the in the? Um... Uh, he rides another one too later on. But yes, this is the reason why he has a bike in the racing game. Because I probably laugh really hard that they make him use the forklift. His forklift is is is, is, is uh, you know is special, but it's I wouldn't want it to actually be you know his normal ride. That. Oh, and you're gonna get your ass whooped if I catch you. Oh, I guess it's fighting time. Uh -huh. I whoop that ass. So bad, punk. Why you? But your time's up. You wish. You wish. Oh. Wait, where did you guys come from? What the fuck? In this harbor and lives to tell about it. It's the bottom of the sea for you. I, I saw that stuff disappear in the back. Kind of whoops my ass. This is hard to do if the camera angle is going to be doing like that. Hello, Mr. Fancy Pants. Time to die. So, until they throw more at me. Ah. Yeah, it's no emotion when you get knocked down. For you. Trying to do that one move. Yeah. Huh. Someone else fast. I guess throws are, are really powerful. Bitch. Uh, how are the bad angels and Chi Ming connected? Uh, uh, I don't know. What? Wait. wait. I don't know if he's his face. Or, but there's some Chinese big shot leaving here soon. Uh, big shot? Yeah. They had me arrange a cruiser to take him out to a big ship offshore. What's his name? Uh, I don't know. But I hear he wears some silk robe thing with a dragon on it. Lan Di. He's still around here. I beg you, don't tell anyone I told you. They'll kill me. Not really my problem. <laughs> 